We're going hunting, sir. Hunting? You know, camping out, the great outdoors. Surrounded by fresh air, just as you prescribed. Hmm, I see. Uh, how long have you been planning this trip? Uh, four, four months. months. Uh, four four months. weeks. <laughs> I, I, I really can't understand how we forgot about your little get-together tonight, sir. Well, I understand it. You do? Of course. <laughs> it was because of your unconscious need to break out into the open. It drove tonight's gathering completely from your mind. Oh, yeah, completely. Yes. Yeah. It sounds so simple when you explain it, sir. <laughs> well, after all, it is my profession. The dynamics of human relations. Well, you're the doctor. <laughs> well, all right, gentlemen. I, um, I'll make your excuses at the meeting tonight. Oh, Mrs. Bellows is going to be terribly disappointed, but uh, your mental and physical well-being is far more important than attending our little gathering. Well, I knew you'd understand. Thank you, sir. <laughs> uh, tell Mrs. Bellows we're going to miss her hors d'oeuvres. <laughs> <laughs> Brilliant. I mean, brilliant. Well, I feel like he'll lying to Dr. Bellows like that. Are you kidding? With one stroke, you got us out of a dull evening into, into the my party of the year. And anyway, we weren't lying. We are going hunting. <laughs> well, Dr. Bellows finds out about the party. Will you stop worrying? There's not a chance in the world. They're quite the right shade, but thank you. I'll look around a bit. Good morning. May I help you, madam? Yes, please. I would like to buy a mod outfit like the mannequin is wearing. Certainly, madam. Here we are. Oh. Well, I, I am terribly sorry to bother you, but may I have the dress without the patches? The dress doesn't come without the patches. Oh, I think it does now. Madam, I dressed that mannequin my... <laughs> Stand. It's a Phyllis de Beck, and she always puts patches on her designs. I'm sorry, I'm positive I haven't another one like it. <laughs> oh, look, I think I found it. <laughs> You can pay the cashier. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, can you tell me, please, where can I buy a mod jacket for my master? Uh, for a man? In the men's section. Over there. Thank you. Sorry, it's the furthest out tie we carry. Sir, wow, that's kicky. Your guy must be a real ding dong. Ding dong? A bell ringer. You know, with it, going. Oh, going. Oh, yes, Major Nelson and I are going to Major Heaty's house tonight for a party. <laughs> Ginny, are you ready? Almost, Master. Yeah, we don't want to be late. There. Here I am. Hey. Hey. Nice. Do you like it? Oh, it's adorable. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, Master. What? You cannot go in this. Oh, well, Ginny, that's a, it's a tuxedo. I, I, I think I can get away with it. I'm a surprise for you. Yeah. Well, this is all I have, see. <laughs> well, oh. How about that? Um, I can't wear that. I, I don't have anything to go with it. Oh, yes, Master. <laughs> oh. Well, gee, I yeah. Here it is. Oh, yes, Master. You look adorable in it. <laughs> it fits you beautifully. Well, it's, it's not it's not really bad, is it? It's I like the color, too. Yeah? How, how about the bell bottom? Huh? Beautiful, beautiful. Whoops. Whoops. Shall we go? <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. 